incredible. This is how the city could thrive all the way out here. The whole place must be fed by an underground spring. It's clean. It's amazing it's still running after all these years. That's a hell of a thing. What? No. <clears throat> no. Please. Sully.
No. No. <laughs> no. No. Stay away, please. Oh, God. Oh, no. What is this? It's moving. I gotta get out. I gotta get out of here. No, no, no. No. I can't do this. What is this? What's happening? Oh. <laughs> 
Oh my god. Ah. Of a time. What's the matter with you? How do I know you're real? Ow! That real enough for you? <sighs> Don't ever point a gun at me again. <sighs> I saw them shoot you. Right after the eclipse. What? What eclipse? Look, kid, you went nuts right after you drank from that fountain. It's the water. That's what destroyed the city. Not the wrath of God. The whole water supply is tainted with some sort of hallucinogenic agent. Must have drove everyone mad. That's what Marlowe and Talbot are after. Oh, man, yeah. Remember, Cutter said they controlled their enemies through fear. <laughs> this'll do it. In spades. But, wait, it doesn't make any sense. How do they think they're getting the water out of here? No, no, it's not the water. It's what's in the water. Come again? All right, listen, just bear with me for a sec. Selim told me that Aram was cursed when Solomon imprisoned the evil spirits of the Jinn inside a vessel of brass, and then cast it into the depths of the city. A genie in a bottle. I know, it sounds pretty crazy. So you reckon that's why Elizabeth and Dee sent Francis Drake out here in the first place? Yeah. It wasn't treasure they were after. It was power. Only once Drake realized what he'd been sent for, he abandoned the mission. He lied to the Queen, told her he didn't find anything, and then hid all traces of his voyage. Rewrote history. Well, who will we to argue with Sir Francis? When you say we head down there and end this thing, once and for all.
Look at this place. This whole city's resting on this cavern. Doesn't look very safe, does it? That's an understatement. We gotta find a way down there. Get Harry. You ready for this? Let's do it. <clears throat> Amazing. This is how they move the water to the surface. God. Look at the ceiling here. I'm surprised the whole place hasn't come crashing down yet. I don't know how the hell it's still standing. We gotta get across there. Help me with this door. <sighs> Shit, get down! Looking for them. Down this way. Ah, crap! Sully, we got more company! Going into the water. Hey. <laughs> Sweet. I'm holding on to this. Sully, help me with this. We gotta get through here.
There's the central cistern. That's where they're gonna be. You ready for this? Aye. Oh, yeah. This is the bridge they were crossing. Must be where they're headed. Careful! Lift it gently. You gotta be kidding me. We gotta take that thing out. Any ideas? Well, they sure as hell got us outnumbered. Let's, uh, let's split up. Try to flank them. Yeah, better odds that way. Swallow any of that water. I, I don't think so. Okay. Jesus. This is why we can't have nice things. Come on, we gotta move. Oh. I have a nickel. Keep them away from Marlo. Everybody out! What's with these guys? Do we know we're gonna be buried here? Look, it tells me they don't care. I sure as hell do.
Nathan! Drake! Are you worthy of the name? Earn this, as Francis earned it from Elizabeth. Prove your greatness! I got nothing to prove. Harry, give me a hand! You can't just let her die! Harry can't! Hey, give me your goddamn hand! Here! Grab it! What the hell are you doing? I can't! I can't! It's no good! Get the Hold hell on. out of there! Hold on!
my god. Yalawi. <laughs> so much for immeasurable wealth, huh? Well. It's not much, is it? It's enough. Hold up a minute, Nate. You okay? Yeah. Yeah, I just got something to need saying, that's all. All right. What is it? Look, I, um... I had a lousy father. A lousy childhood. I hit 40, I figured I was never gonna have a son of my own. Hell, I never wanted one. What the hell do I know about raising a kid? <laughs> then you came barreling into my life. Look, you don't have to... No, listen. I do. I have made a lot of mistakes, kid. A lot. <laughs> and, uh... Well, I am not a perfect man. You're not proposing, are you, Sally? I mean, I love you, uh, but... Stop. Just stop being a wise-ass for one second. How long have you been carrying that around? Too long. Thought I'd lost it. Here's the thing, kid. We don't get to choose how we start in this life. Real greatness, it's what you do with the hand you dealt. Hey. Hey. Going somewhere? Maybe. I'm really sorry about your ring. Yeah. It's all right. I swapped it for something better. <laughs> Let's get out of here, huh? Yeah. Come on, we're this way. But... Come on. Trust me. <laughs> what are you up to? <laughs> no way. Eh, it's not as nice as the one you two wrecked four years ago, but it'll do. <laughs> Come on. See if I can remember how to fly the goddamn thing. Hey, this has parachutes, right? Oh, yeah. Three. Eh, more or less. <laughs> 